Jackson are cool. You know, they're cool. I don't know this dude's name because it's in Japanese, I believe. When you learn new song with your ear, do you speed down songs with your computer program or cell phone applications? Any other tips? It's too difficult to learn fast leads or thrashy rhythm only with my ear. Haha, <laughs> and I love your cat. Cool. Uh, it's my friend's cat and I was house sitting. Uh, so now I don't slow down anything. I don't use anything. <clears throat> I know there's good programs out there to use. I don't know what any of them are. I'm sorry. I just, uh, all, all the stuff that I'm showing on my channel, like guitar lessons and things that like Rat and the Van Halen, like I've known that stuff for, you know, 20 years. So I don't have to relearn it. I already know it. Um, but I did learn it by ear. And back in the day, which was like 1985, 86, 87, I would just put the record on and put it in that neutral end and just slow that motherfucker down with my hand. And I know that the pitch would change, but I would at least know the order of the notes. So that's how I did it. Now it would be way easy. I'm sure every audio program that you get would be able to slow it down, you know, you know, 30%, 50%, whatever you want, uh, an octave, that kind of thing. So, and now they've got ones where it, it'll slow it down, but the pitch stays the same. So, I mean, my God, it's crazy. You motherfuckers are spoiled. That's all I'm gonna say. Ninix, Ninix, Ninix. A lot of people these days say rock is dead, are saying rock is dead. What's your take on the matter? Well, I don't fucking care. <laughs> like dead, not dead. It ain't dead to me. Um, I don't listen to it as much as I used to. Not rock anyways, but you know, I guess what they're saying by rock is dead is that in our new, you know, financial climate, the way the world is going, there's gonna be no rock stars like, like there was in the 70s or whatever the fuck. But I mean, as far as metal goes, man, there's, there will never not be metal. That's just a fact. There's so many fucking metal bands now um, that, that, that it's out of control. But I think they're saying maybe like rock music as the most popular music in the world that's been eclipsed by hip hop, but you come on, you know what I know that commercial radio is fucking dog shit. Um, so I don't know, is rock dead to you? It's not dead to me. It's it's where it should be, underground, baby. I guess I don't know. Fuck. Don't make me think. Carl Stevens, what are your musical guilty pleasures? Songs, bands, singers. Um, at work, I listen to a lot of uh, UK drum and bass. I listen to a lot of Pendulum. I listen to no metal at all because that'll just rev me up. I try to stay calm because I'm a, I run hot. Um, I like The Waitresses. I've got their whole discography on my phone. It's not very, it's not very big at all. Um, I like The Orb, which is like uh, ambient fucking techno, I guess you'd say. Um, I listened to a, a Polish jazz singer named Basia, and her, I think her last name is Chebczleska. It's, but she's like, she's like mad. So I'm trying to think of what else. Listen to a lot of Steely Dan. Um, d guilty. No, I'm pretty, uh, like I'm not, I'm not embarrassed about any of the music I listen to. People trip out on some of it. Uh, I like a lot of, um, Bossa Nova stuff. I like a lot of uh, 50s and 60s uh, lounge music, like that tiki kind of shit. Uh, I used to listen to Susie and the Banshees a lot. Um, fuck. And the Cocktoo Twins. Love the Cocktoo Twins. I met Elizabeth Frazier in San Francisco once. I made her give me a hug instead of signing something. So, yeah. All right, let's 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 move on. Uh, look, I listen to everything that I feel is good and I avoid things that I feel are shit. Just like everybody else, I think. Unless you want to have a laugh. Slap Fart Media, who I find funny. He's, he's commented on a few of my videos. He says, first, congratulations on reaching 11,000 subs and the growing fan base. Second, awesome t-shirt. And my question is, where can I get said t-shirt? Okay, the t-shirt he's talking about was the video probably before this. Um, where I'm playing, where I'm wearing the, uh, black metal Van Halen shirt. <clears throat> Dude, I had that made. 
Like I found the font online and then had a buddy get it printed on a shirt for me and that's it. So that's all you gotta do. Know somebody who prints shirts and you're fucking in there. Slap Fart Media, you're fucking hilarious. Dave Lawrence, who do you think is better, Warren or George? Wow, that's a good one. Um, I'm gonna say when Warren was at the out of the cellar uh, era time, I'm gonna say Warren. I'm gonna say George. George has always been pretty consistent until lately. Um, I love Warren. I I just love George more, you know? You love what you love, I guess, when you hear it when you're a kid. And I, I was got into Dawkins pretty, I think, before Rat even. So, but I mean, they're, they're kind of a lot alike, you know? So I, I do love them both. And, but Warren, Warren got into like blues. Like, have you seen that, the White Snake uh, Bad Boys? Uh, video on YouTube where it's live and Warren's the other guitar player. Like, he's so fucking bluesy and there's like fuck all gain on his guitar. Um, now, I'm always wanting the person that I love to put, put on more gain and go harder. Like, I was pretty upset when Paul Gilbert went bluesy. I was fucking, no, I was actually pretty gutted. I was pretty fucking pissed off, but that, that's for another time. I like my dudes to go more metal. If you start metal, I want you to go harder, never softer. Shred Guitar Kev asks, how do you control your vibrato using nines? Pretty fucking easy. You just bend and release. I don't know. I use 11s on my 24.75 seal guitars and 10s on my 25.5 scale shit and anything lighter feels like goddamn rubber bands. You must have really strong hands in or something. Uh, and when I go to bend, I sound like Kirk Hammett. Okay, you're bending too fucking fast. You need to slow that shit down. Try to bend to the tempo of the song or something. I don't know. If you're sounding like Kirk Hammett, fix it.